In this video, we're going to talk about stopping and starting the engine based on interior cabin temperature. It's really a simple selection of the conditions that you want and the temperatures that you want. In order to set stop start based on temperature, you're going to have to have the optional thermistor, either from LGS Group or from your own thermistor that you acquire. You're going to go to the configuration screen. We're going to scroll down to temperature preconditions, and there's several settings here. First of all, in the first section, these are preconditions. These are the conditions required so that EcoStar can go active. We have minimum ambient air temperature. We have maximum ambient air temperature. Why would you use those? Say if the temperature outside is minus 10 degrees or colder, we may decide we don't want EcoStar to go active. It's just too cold. If we want a maximum temperature, you may say if it's over 100 degrees outside, it's just too warm today. The vehicle is going to be starting and stopping too rapidly because of the ambient temperature inside the cab. Especially on a hot day with the sun beating in through the windshield, it can get up over 100 degrees very quickly. You're going to have engine coolant temperature, a minimum engine coolant temperature for gas, and a minimum engine coolant temperature for diesel. This is important because on a cold day, you want to be able to make sure that the engine is warmed up so that the defroster can defrost the windshield or you can heat up the inside of the vehicle without shutting off. You also have a maximum engine coolant temperature setting to help ensure that you don't overheat the engine. Next is actually setting the thermostat. Here's where you get to decide at what temperature do I want to restart the engine and then at what temperature do I want to shut the engine off, both for cold and for heat. So what we have here is low temperature restart. We're going to, in this particular case, this is a function that you can enable or disable. If you enable it, you must have a thermistor for this to work. Low temp restart says that if the temperature inside the cab gets below 40 degrees Fahrenheit, restart the engine. It will then warm up to 55 degrees and then shut off again. On the high side, we're going to have, if the temperature gets warmer than 90 degrees, restart the engine, cool it down to 75, then shut off again. Please note that the only vehicle that we can actually turn on the heater or AC is on a Ford Utility police interceptor. All other vehicles, the heat or the AC must be on for the system to be able to effectively cool down or warm up the vehicle. 